Well, Sophie is our uh, Belgian farmhouse ale, or Cezanne. Um, back in the day in, in France and Belgium, most farmers, a lot of farmers, uh, they were little family farms. And so what the farmer did is the winter before, he would brew a batch of beer with his own wheat and barley and brew that for the guest workers. So when they came in and they helped with the harvest, they had a nice refreshing beer. And those beers were generally strong enough to last from the winter to the summer, but also nice and refreshing. And then often they would either hop them extra or spice them right before they served them, give them a little bit more fresh flavor. We brew Sophie kind of the traditional way with all Pilsner malt. So it's got a nice pale character. It's got a little bit of haze in there, which is traditional. We actually um, take some of the beer out of the fermenter and put it into oak barrels. And in those oak barrels, we zest about 20 pounds of oranges. And we blend it all back together. Then you get a beer that's got a lot of that nice citrus nose on it, combined with that, that hop character from the Amarillo. And then, then you go into the body, which is it's, it's pretty highly carbonated. Of course, we needed to come up with a name for the beer. So I looked to my favorite of the Belgian Cezanne producers, and they're all pretty much like family breweries. So it's a really nice kind of family feel. And Goose Island's a family brewery too. My father really started it back in 1988, still is active every day. I run the, the brewing end, and then um, our next generation is my daughter Sophie. So we named it after her to kind of keep it in the family. Sophie is a beer that has got a little bit of that Brett yeast still in the bottle with it, so it'll continue to develop a little bit more flavor as it stays in the bottle. So we put a five-year date code on that. I know that Sophie's a natural with lighter tasting dishes because it's pretty light. We really like it with, with seafood. We like it a lot with raw oysters. We like it with sushi. We like it with salmon. So we put all that together and you've got a beer that is very refreshing, uh, very delicious. It's a perfect match.